Hi guys and welcome to the Miles Better channel. Today we're going to be looking at contact in bio and recording uh, some of the interface and the dashboard. Hope you're going to enjoy this. It's a great new uh, link that uh, basically allows you to put a bio link on your Instagram. As you well may not know, you cannot put a clickable link inside your posts. However, this is a workaround, a little bit like Shoreby or Linktree. This is the latest player in the market, contact in bio. Uh, we've decided to give it a go as we, uh, we like trying new things. It's available from um, AppSumo. It's currently on an agency lifetime package. Um, so extremely worth, extreme value at this moment in time. So I'm going to... Basically, in this small video, I'm going to show you how to uh, edit a link, check some of the other videos for some of the other fun things that we do. So how are we going to go? Well, as you can see, we're on the dashboard and we're going to go into quite simply edit. As you will see, I've got quite a lot of uh, options up already and we're going to create a new link um, to a feature on the top. So we're going to click link. Not really difficult. We're going to choose an icon if we want it. And in this case, we'll have a little bit of fun uh, and let's see what we can have. Perhaps we'll have uh, a thumbs up. Let's have a thumbs up. So that's pretty cool. And now we're going to link to the URL that we want. I have it open on a tab already. We're going to go down here and we're going to talk about a workshop that we're going to promote. And we're going to copy that link. We're going to come across here and we're going to right click and place on the URL. We're going to give it a title of the is. This in this case is free. Um, what do we want to call this? This is uh, six figure income training. All right, let's try and make it a bit catchy. Uh, that's going to tie in with the image, uh, etc. Tells you what it is. There's there's the little thumbs up. We like the preview. We're going to keep the thumbnail. We don't. We could put a picture, but I think at this time we're just going to keep it simple. Here's an example of where we have used a picture. But more importantly, I like to think we're going to come down here and we're going to add. Okay, that's added it. That's great. Uh, it usually adds it at the bottom here, but actually what will happen is that we can have it featured at the top. And then what we want to do is just want to have a quick look at the preview, see where that's come. And it has ended up further down at the bottom. We've got that one there and it's all the way at the bottom, I think. Where is it gone? Uh, nope, there it is, right at the top because it's the latest one as I had hoped. Now you notice this one is bouncing. That's quite fun. We can add some uh, personalization to that. And I think we'll do the same here for this one. So we're going to come back out of there. And now we're going to just got to find it. As I said, it's likely to be at the bottom. We're going to edit. Now, this is where we can come down to the bottom here. We can, this, we can see the priority link. And we can have this time, let's give it a little shake. And we're going to save. And that, guys, is how you add a new link. Let's put a little preview on it. And now, as you can see, there we go. There he is, right at the top, giving a little shake. It's installed, ready to go, and that's it. So, guys, hope you enjoyed this little video on how to add a new link. Do check out some of the other videos where we will review some of these other little buttons. Uh, but uh, we'll, uh, thanks for signing in. So thanks for watching. If you like this video and found it helpful, please comment below. Share it uh, to your friends. Obviously, subscribe with the button below. I'd love to have you join our channel. And, uh, of course, if you haven't already got this product, then use the content, contact in bio link also below in the description to uh, sign up today. Thanks, guys.